And I'm Dave Kaiser. Thanks for joining us on Community Corner at the Plymouth Library with Luann Swenson. And she is here to tell us a little bit more about Plymouth Reads, all the fun going on. Tell us a little bit about the event. Why do you have it each year? This is the seventh year of Plymouth Reads and we have it because we, uh, well our mission statement says to find common ground, build community through reading a single book. Mm -hmm. And tell us about the book this year. I know you spend a lot of time picking the book. We what do. is the book? We do. In fact, we have an entire book club that pre-reads and, and critiques books, trying to find the right one. This one um, is called Miss Hazel and the Rosa Parks League. It takes place in um, pre-civil rights south, uh, about two women who find common ground and change a community. Mm -hmm. In this time of a uh, certain amount of racial unrest, it seemed like an excellent time to kind of look back right. uh, to the 60s and see how far we've come and where we need to go. And for people that want to stop by the library, you've got a lot set up here. Tell us a we little do. bit about the displays, especially what's we up do. front. We were lucky enough to, to get an exhibit from the Hennepin History Museum of the Voting Rights Act of 1965. Uh, Minnesotans had a big hand in passing that legislation to guarantee voting rights mm -hmm. to all citizens. And um, so we're real proud to share that exhibit of theirs and it's going to be in the library until the end of Plymouth Reads, which is April 17th. All right, and there are many events that go on throughout Plymouth Reads. Stay right there, we'll talk to you more about those events Excellent. in a second. Right now, here's a look at some other things happening in the Northwest area. A family archery event is coming up Sunday, April 24th from 10 a.m. to noon at Sahaki Park in Robbinsdale. To find out more or to sign up, go to threeriversparks.org. The popular bike rodeo is Wednesday, May 4th from 6 to 8 p.m. at Sonneson Elementary School. Kids can test their bike safety skills and get a free bike safety check. Go to goldenvalleymn.gov for more details. Back at the Plymouth Library talking about the Plymouth Reads event going on. Luann joining us once again. Tell us a little bit about some of the festivities. A lot going on. You can find it on the website, but tell us about some of the favorites that are coming up. Certainly. Uh, Primavera in Plymouth at Plymouth Creek Center. The big highlight of our event mm -hmm. is when the author Jonathan O'Dell will speak and take questions. Now that's at 6.30 on Sunday night, April 17th. Okay. Um, so that it winds it all up. But in the meantime, we have a book discussion similar to a book club at the library that's free for anyone who wants to stop in and talk about the book. Mm -hmm. uh, we also are screening a great movie about the Voting Rights Act uh, that stars Danny Glover called Freedom Song. Uh, so that's also free and at the library. And we have a teen event coming up on t right away this coming Tuesday at four o'clock for any teens who are interested in a writing career or are interested in talking about the book or meeting the author. All right, everyone should get involved Plymouth Reads. Thank you very much, Luann. Mm -hmm. If you want more information, hclib.org. Just look for the Plymouth location.